Hey, what's going on guys? Today's video, we are going to install some bike graphics number plate decals on 2017 PW50 and a 17 KTM 50 SX. And uh, this is how they are right now. Just got a, some basic numbers on the KTM uh, for Grayson and uh, nothing on the P-Dub for, for Graham. Uh, really all you need to do, grab yourself a heat gun or a hair dryer if that's what you got. Um, I do have a heat gun that I, uh, I've used for my boat and stuff like that. So the only other thing you're really going to need is some isopropyl alcohol or rubbing alcohol and a rag. And um, of course, you got to get your graphics. And this is our first time ordering. So we ordered from Bike Graphics. Uh, we hit up the Memorial Day sale and got, I think it was 30% off the entire order. So for Grayson's KTM, uh, his number there, it's his, his birthday. Uh, for Graham... He got uh, black with, with white numbers, and uh, that's his actual, uh, the day of his birthday. So they both have 29 in the number, so that's kind of cool. Uh, they totally hooked us up. They got some mini plates for Graham and for Grayson. I don't think that those are typically uh, included, but they totally hooked us up and got some bike graphics decals that we'll probably put on the bikes and uh, the Wrecking Crew graphics. Of course, comes with directions. Um, it's got yourself a squeegee. And like I said, other than the isopropyl alcohol and maybe a heat gun or, or uh, you know, hair dryer, just in case you, you get some wrinkles or bubbles. Uh, other than that, we're going to get to uh, getting the old graphics off, putting the new ones on. What do you think, Graham? How's that look? Yes. Yeah, baby. Think, is it gonna fit? Put it on there, let's see if it fits the spot. Thinking so. Does that look like a winner? Yep. 
Yes, sir. So first, we are gonna have to Mom, look at my take off Mom? his I old decal, of course, his old number. And then this stock OEM sticker here has got to come off because the whole number plate covers that up, but that's gonna look good anyway. So we're gonna get to removing the stickers on the KTM 50. So this one here, obviously with the KTM, we've got a few different dimensions here. You've got a high, high area on the plate with one angle and then a really sharp turn and angle up here. So what I think I'm gonna do is just get it where I think I want it. Um, obviously the hole is one of the easiest ways to line this entire thing up and make sure that you know, you're, you're on point with, with where you want the decal to be. And I'm gonna essentially start here knowing that this is the high spot. And then I'll probably end up working, working this top one down because it's a really, really sharp angle. So I'll get that set with the high area and then we'll work on the front side of this decal. All right, sorry about that guys. It started to kind of rain and obviously not uh, a good combination for, for decal application, but That's pretty close right here. So I'm gonna work on this high spot or this high area of the plate first. There's a sharp crease on this plate at the top. So that's how I'm kind of trying to get to that point. And as it comes down, I'm just trying to keep it from getting any bubbles. And obviously heat on this part will certainly help you as you navigate the contours of the plastic. You want to ride? Yeah, I'm like, yeah, well. 
All right, guys, so just a couple tips for you. One, take, take your time. You know, patience is key with, with decals. This is my first time ever doing uh, motocross bikes. And like I said, the, the side of the KTM here with the exhaust and the bolt hole was actually one of the hardest because of the angles on the mold of the fender. Um, but yeah, patience is key. And two, a heat gun works tremendously well. Um, even if you get bubbles, you can heat it up and uh, you know lay it back down and it's nice and soft, it's pliable. And, and it lays back down pretty nice. So, um, you know, Harbor Freight, Home Depot, it's 20 bucks for a heat gun, and I use, I use it for a lot of things. So um, I'll go ahead and show you guys the bikes.